We begin tonight with Vancouver Islanders coming together to celebrate the life of a homegrown hero. From humble beginnings bagging groceries as a teen, Alex Campbell Sr. built the Thrifty Foods Empire. He was also one of Vancouver Island's greatest philanthropists, donating millions. Campbell died on October 11th. This afternoon, more than 1,000 people packed a memorial to a remarkable man. Joe Campbell said if love could have saved Alex, he would still be here today. And that is true. Alex was dearly loved by Joe and by his children and by his grandchildren. He was loved and he was respected by thousands of Thrifty Foods employees and by thousands more, tens of thousands in the community who have been touched and helped by his legendary generosity. Alex woke up one morning and thought about ways he could bring joy to children and to families in need at Christmas time. He chose to help CFAX Santa's Anonymous, which I will never forget. And he continued to do so for 30 consecutive years. In many ways, uh, he was an anonymous Santa to thousands and thousands of people who didn't know it was Alex who was helping. Every time I came to the island, he would take me on a tour of the stores and would invariably chat with those at work. They called him Mr. Campbell, and he replied using their name and very often asking about someone in their family. After all, they were also his neighbors, and he cared about each and every one. It was impossible to spend time with him and not be moved by his wisdom. Alex has left this world a better place than when he found it. And more, much more. His staff at Thrifty Foods knew him fondly as Mr. C to his grandchildren. He was Grandpa, Grampy or Poppy. To Vancouver Islanders, he truly was a homegrown hero. On behalf of the Campbell family, thank you for being here today. Uh, please feel free to stay after the service and uh, share stories and enjoy some refreshments. And remember what Alex would say, life is short, eat your dessert first. Thank you. Thank you.